Hi, Kobikovsky reporting in. In this video I'm going to show you in time-lapse a building process of Kobe Panther Ausf G tank. This is a second version of this German tank by Kobe. Let's check what exactly was changed and possibly improved. After a quick build section of this video I will state my first impressions and make a quick review of this product.
Okay, work completed. Of course, it was very fun to build and generally this is a good looking, functional and sturdy toy. But I will not only praise Kobe for this model, as next to a list of advantages, I noted a couple of disadvantages that will affect my final score. Let's go back to 2014. When this first Panther has been released by Kobe, it was like a revelation to me. It seemed almost perfect. That was a significant improvement on first batch of World War II tanks from Kobe. New specialized parts, like those wheel discs, some very good details, better minifigs and weapons, the only real problem of this first panther is that the gun has a tendency to fall to the lowest position. As Kobe failed here to, to design a you know, proper construction hinge or a set of elements that could provide enough friction to hold this quite heavy barrel. Uh, the temporary solution for that is to squeeze those uh, slopes a bit and that, that, will, that will help. You know, but generally, in my opinion, with this model, Kobe made huge two or even three steps forward. And now we have this new Panther tank that Kobe marked as AUSG. And I have mixed feelings. I could summarize it as two steps forward and one step backward. But I will try to point out all most important pros and cons. I will start with what I really like about it. Kobe improved gun lane feature using their new strong hinge elements, two of them, and now it, it works very good. Another thing, look, better, almost perfect seat or, or mantlet of front machine gun. Another thing, amazing sound of uh, trucks clicking when rolling the tank. You know, I like it a lot. It's it's very realistic, you know. And another thing is that good camouflage. I know that uh, many of you will not like it, as most um, camouflages from uh, wo of tanks of World War II um, had natural shapes and foliage-like patterns, um, and it's extremely difficult to 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 make it out of just out of uh, bricks um, of multiple colors so uh, you know to do it right probably um, we'll have to use uh, many parts um, customized with uh, by our own with uh, with uh, paint or you know printed uh, printed pieces with, you know, with camouflage, that would be very, very difficult. Uh, and now I, I think uh, that's a good try, uh, what Kobe did here, uh, using uh, green, light brown and sand bricks. Plus, uh, we have a decent, a decent collection of, of many, many, many parts um, of different colors that could be, of course, used uh, in our mocks or, um, or to, to modify the, the, the camouflage on, on this tank. Uh, so, you know, generally I like, I like the camouflage, but I know that this could be also counted as a disadvantage. Another nice thing is that uh, Kobe released new STG44 carbine mold it's very nice. And one more thing, uh, 
despite the fact I like those details on First Panther better, uh, I'd like to draw your attention to this new element uh, that could be used also in other uh, places. You know, we can see that this is a kind of a ventilation or uh, fan, uh, fan cover or something like that. And we have a very nice feature, a hatch and an engine compartment uh, housing a, an engine. Very nice backside. These uh, mufflers uh, are also uh, made of uh, metallic like silver, uh, silver plastics. So it's, it's very nice. And now those disadvantages. Okay. Look. This tank now is strikingly too wide. It is as wide as Kobe Tiger 2 tank. Uh, this is, you know, this is unacceptable for me. And, and I'll have to modify it somehow. Another thing is that what I uh, said before, that Kobe uh, reduced uh, significantly reduced the number of details on on the tank look now we have no spare uh, track links uh, no shovels or pickaxe um, you know no uh, no antennas no hoses no you know I even preferred the those uh, fans better you know look it, it's, it is better in, in any aspect. So, I don't like the, the changes in, in, in this area. And generally, I want to say that um, this model, in, you know, in terms of, of details, this model is a victim of a strange Kobe policy to, to stick at all costs to, to fixed number of elements. On certain sets for example th those uh, tanks um, in this size so most medium medium tanks are limited to 400 bricks and, and not a single br brick more so I understand that uh, when they wanted to to uh, to include those side skirts on both sides they had to limit uh, the number of elements elsewhere. I think this is a bad, bad decision and uh, the model uh, suffers from it. Now the, uh, the hull uh, seems very, you know, very... I, well, I don't like it. It's, it's, it's not good enough. So I, I'll have to modify it myself and probably I'll make a... I will make a hybrid of, of these uh, two models. One more thing is that I, as a military enthusiast and an advanced user of bricks, uh, I, I see it clearly that the slope angle of uh, side armor plates is, um, is too, too flat. You know the the side armor plates were steeper, like like that. I guess the uh, this uh, slope angle was thirty degrees out of vertical. So you know that must be fixed. Uh, and I um, to include those side skirts, I will probably um, reduce the number of of studs by one. I know, I understand that it, it would be much, much di more difficult to uh, to design the the center of of this of this tank, but it's possible. It's possible. Uh, generally, the the main task of of a guy who is collecting Kobe tanks is to is to design a 
his own mocks of a smaller size. Summarizing. This is a good-looking, functional and sturdy toy. Generally, high-quality toy. Bricks are just slightly below Lego quality. This is a good representation of the Panther tank, but more advanced users will have to modify it heavily to make it really close to Panzerkampfwagen 5 Panther. Thank you for watching. Bye.